It is the year 1493 and the rich trading city of Moorburg is continuously growing. But the medieval city wall blocks city expansion. So what to do? Across the river lies a peninsula. Though space there is slightly limited, it offers great protection and access to the water and consequently a bridge is built. The growing burger class during the renaissance builds their houses and plant rectangular blocks compared to the irregular shapes of the medieval city center. This planned grid stretches all the way from the river confluence to the district center with church and market square and further to modern fortifications. Now enough with 16th century and renaissance urban history. Today this district is a hit with tourists. Before I explain why that is, I want to show you the real life inspiration for this area. The German city of Koblenz sits at a river confluence and features historical riversides, old buildings, plazas, churches and other tourist attractions. Though the peninsula between the rivers Rhine and Mosul is wider than our in-game example and city history and consequently expansion differs drastically, I still took a lot of inspiration from it, especially for riverside detailing. Talking about the riverside, the city expansion also sits atop an old sandbank that nowadays is used as an urban beachfront and parkland. A huge amount of tourists and inhabitants of the city frequent the area and the restaurants and shopping malls atop the key walls and boardwalks. But not only old, but also modern developments make this area unique. The 2000s saw the construction of a large ferry and river cruise ship terminal, a cable car connecting to the hill fortress on the other riverside, and modern green apartments. Closer to the river confluence, next to the elevated train station, offices, malls, and other large buildings are located. Hopefully you feel inspired by this renaissance era built in city skylines and can see how different layouts and building styles display the history of a city. If you want to know more about how cities grew historically, check out this video on the left. Also check out the recommended video on the right to see other types of city skylines content that I create. Thanks for watching.